People love fresh seafood, but where does this delicious food come from? Most is grown and caught right here in Texas, in the bays and estuaries along our coast. If you traveled along Texas's almost 400 miles of coastline, you would find over 2.6 million acres of estuary habitat and seven major bays. Estuaries form along the coast where streams or rivers empty into the Gulf and mix with seawater. A bay is partially enclosed by land and opens to the ocean. Bays are like big mixing bowls where freshwater inflows create salinity gradients that expand and contract with seasons, droughts, tides, and floods. Along with fresh water, the inflows also bring nutrients and sediments that feed fish, wildlife, invertebrates, phytoplankton and zooplankton, as well as seagrass plants. All of this activity allows our bays and estuaries to become giant nurseries for young aquatic life. And this productivity shows. Our bays and estuaries grow more seafood than anywhere else in the country, over 100 million pounds annually, which makes a big impact on the Texas economy. But over the last century, about 50% of Texas coastal wetlands have been filled in, eroded away, or otherwise destroyed. Up to 60% of the seagrass beds are gone, and over 50% of the oyster reefs no longer exist. And each year, new demands for water upstream have altered freshwater inflow from rivers meeting the coast. We need to keep an eye on the human impact in our bays and estuaries, not just for maintaining a place to catch seafood, but for all of the birds, animals, and all aquatic life that depend on these vital ecosystems.